Welcome back to another episode of Funked Up Gaming. I'm Levi, and today we're playing Water Me. Which is apparently like a post-apocalyptic take care of your plant game. So I'm, I'm down to try it. So, congratulations! You're a new plant parent. It's your job to nurture your new friend. What will you name it? Um, what should I name my new plant? We'll name it Bootsy. Because, you know, funk. So, here we go. Okay! Oh, look at my little plant! I want to talk to my plant. I'm going to say, oh yeah. Hello, gorgeous. Uh, sometimes I really feel like you get me. And look how healthy you look. I'm a plant wizard. I don't want to prune the leaves. It's, it's a little small to be pruning the leaves. I want to fill the glass. And then water the plant. Which I just apparently just decided to just throw water on the plant. So, yeah, but I've already talked to the plant. Um, yeah. It wasn't that. Let there be light. Uh, I don't want to prune the leaves. He's too small to prune the leaves. Okay. I guess let's go to the next day. Oh, uh, did he grow? Looking unbelievably fresh today. <laughs> So I want to fill the glass and water the plant. Just, that's not how you water plants, but you know, we're gonna put on the. Oh, well, we can put on the news, I guess. Hey, the news Hi, I'm is Laura obvious. Hansberger and you're listening to South Carolina Focus. With me here today is Matthew Whitehouse, the observatory manager for the South Carolina State Museum. So Matthew, Kay. I have this right. A lunar eclipse is when the sun, earth, and moon line up with each other so that the earth casts a shadow on the moon. But this eclipse is called a super eclipse. What does that mean? Um, so a I super eclipse. By saying that all lunar eclipses happen uh, when the moon is full. Uh, so this is a so-called super moon eclipse, and all that really means is that this particular full moon, when the eclipse is happening, is when the moon is closest to the earth in its orbit. So because of this, when the moon is a so-called supermoon, it actually can appear slightly bigger in our sky, not dramatically bigger. So if you're looking up on a supermoon or for the supermoon eclipse and you're expecting the moon to Who look cares? really, really big this in is the it. sky, it's actually... Hey, I'm tired of listening to your supermoon conversation. We can try and prune the leaves a little, but I don't want to prune them too much. Ooh, someone's looking succulent today. I'm not going to tell him he looks terrible. That's awful. Okay, so... We're going to go the next day. See what we got. It is... Snowy? Outside? I bet you'd like some sun. Good sun, wouldn't you? Here, let's turn on the lamp. That, it's a good sun substitute. Water the plant. Prune the leaves. And what else is on the news? For South Carolina Public Radio, this is South Carolina Focus. I'm Tut Underwood. Going through his collection, Harvey Teal of Columbia recalls interesting times putting it together. I don't care. So, the only thing I could find out was there's going to be a super moon. Ah, super moon. Which is just a moon that's bigger. Because science so okay so i think I, I think i did everything let's go the next day oh it's raining that's south carolina public radio according to the state's emergency management division why the city of columbia's mayor steve benjamin says that although rain may not seem threatening the roads may be dangerous 12 inches of water can float a small suv Okay, the weather says it's going to be rain, and the rain is dangerous, because rain... I will probably listen to the whole broadcast, but, you know, I don't, I don't got all day to be listening to the weather. I got to tell my plant, I bet you'd like some sun, wouldn't you? Because you look a lot better than the weather. Probably. Prune the leaves. Yeah. I've already watered the plant. Let's go the next day. Whoa! Oh, it's gonna flood. I got it. Ew, don't pour the contaminated water. 
Can you just put put it outside? I'm not gonna tell that to the plant. No. Why would you tell that to the? God, you douche. It's just like you're a freaking plant. I hate you. That's awful, awful thing to say. Why would you say stuff like that? If you were outside, you'd be dead. I'm not gonna tell him that. Prune the leaves. Oh God, I pruned them too much. Don't prune the leaves that much. I don't know. It's, it's growing to be a fucking monster plant, though. Don't, don't give it contaminated water. Just. All right, it's smaller now. That's good. Turn on the light. I, I'm not gonna tell that to the plant. That's awful. I don't want to give it contaminated, but it needs water. Oh, I know, but you can't go without water. Mm. I'm not gonna tell my plant, no matter how bad it gets outside. I'm not gonna be all, you know, dickish to my plant. Oh no, the plant's dead. No, you need water. I don't care how. Ah, but no, I gotta keep the plant alive. Have some light. No. No. Damn it. And the wet. Oh, wait, let me guess. Damn it. Gah. What the fuck? Oh. Yeah, I know the weather got bad, and apparently I got all sad about it. But fuck, my plant died. I feel bad now. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's bullshit. Fuck it. We're gonna do it one more time. Well, um, I'm gonna name my plant Larry Graham this time. <laughs> Go ahead and give it all the water we fucking can now, and prune the leaves, and give it light. Tell it it's amazing, and I love it. Yeah, yeah. So I, I just going to no, no news. Just music. I don't give a fuck. The news is depressing. We're gonna go the next day. Look at my plant. It's it's being so awesome. On it's sucking suck fucking succulent today. Prune the leaves. Give it water. Give it light. Awesome. We're doing a good job today. So now what? Okay. So I want to talk to you. You probably want some sun, wouldn't you? I know it's all cloudy. I don't don't tell it the flower. Shut up. You're awful. Awful plant owner. I know. It's, it looks bad outside. I know. It's... Give me some more water. Maybe that'll work. Did I prune it? Oh, I'm fucking pruning it too much. Oh. Don't prune the leaves. Just let it go. I know. If you prune it, it won't hold as much water. I think that's gonna... That's gonna be the thing that saves me. So just, you know... I don't talk to your plant. No, it's gonna fucking die! Anything? No, don't. Fuck. 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 Here we go. One more time. Um. We're gonna name our plant Lewis Johnson. Okay, pay attention, Levi. So, give it water, prune the leaves, let there be light music. Even though the music's awful, but still. Certainly not Larry Graham. So, let there be light. So, fill the glass. Don't prune the plant. Okay, let it grow. Just let it get big and sexy. I'm Laura Huntsberger for South Carolina. Yesterday, no! Music! No! 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 Music! No! There's no music anymore. Now it's just stressful bullshit. I don't want to give it... Damn it, it's water. It looks pretty good so far. I don't want to give it contaminated water. No! Penis buckets. You know, I don't think there is a way to keep your plant alive. I think they're jerking me around. And of course, leave it to me to play a game that's supposed to be atmospheric and like make me sad because, you know, the flood's coming and I can't keep my plant alive. To being like some sort of plant simulator. Way to go, Levi. Way to just miss the point. But that's okay. It was an okay game. Um, people who really like to sit down and, like, really focus and really get into their games. I mean, this would be a good game for them. It's called Water Me. I got it on itch.io. It was free. I recommend it. So, if you liked it, be sure to like 
comment, and subscribe down below. And as always, we'll see you all tomorrow. Love you guys. Bye.